Installing a shade isn't difficult and takes less than 30 minutes. In this video, we will show you how to install a battery-powered roller shade. Before you begin, open the box and make sure you have all of the necessary parts, including the shade, mounting rail, and screws. You'll also need a cordless drill, 3 16 inch drill bit, number 2 Phillips bit, a level, scissors, a screwdriver, tape measure, pencil, and the batteries required for the shade. First, you will need to make sure that the shade you received is the correct size. Next, make sure that both ends of the shade tube are properly inserted into the end brackets. Now, you're ready to install the mounting rail. Hold it up to the window, ensuring that it's level and centered. If this is an inside mount, make sure that there is sufficient clearance between each end of the mounting rail and the window frame. Shades with fascia require one quarter of an inch of clearance per side, and shades without fascia require one eighth of an inch of clearance per side. Decide where to place your mounting screws. They'll need to be approximately three to five inches from each end of the mounting rail. You can place the screws through the top or the back of the mounting rail. The rail features grooves that indicate recommended placement and will help to stabilize the point of your drill bit. Use a pencil to mark screw locations on the mounting rail, then pre-drill the holes for the screws. Please note, shades wider than 48 inches will need two additional screws equally spaced across the mounting rail. Install the mounting rail on the wall, inside the window frame, or on the window frame using the provided screws. If you're installing the shade above the trim, place the included spacers behind the mounting screws to provide additional clearance as the shade lowers. If your shade is 48 inches or wider, you'll need to install the included center support. Position the center support in the middle of the mounting rail and lock it into place. Next, remove the bracket lock labels on either side of the mounting rail and position each one at least one and a half inches towards the center of the mounting rail. Now, you can hang the shade in the mounting bracket. Rest the bottom part of each shade bracket on the lower shelf of the installed mounting rail. If you're installing a shade wider than 48 inches, make sure that the shade is positioned correctly in the center support. Push the top of the shade into the mounting rail. You'll hear a click and the brackets are properly engaged. You can now remove the white paper wraps and packing materials using scissors. Once your shade is installed in the brackets, engage the bracket locks by opening the fascia or head rail and sliding each bracket lock all the way to the end of the mounting rail until it clicks into place. Now you can insert the batteries. Open the fascia or head rail and insert the batteries as indicated. For best battery life, do not mix old and new batteries or battery types. Do not use carbon zinc or rechargeable batteries. We recommend using Duracell or Rayovac brand batteries to achieve published battery lifetime. Once the batteries are installed, the LED indicator light will briefly flash red-green. Close the fascia or head rail by rotating it back into place. That's it for installation. Now you're ready to program your Pico remote control or set up your smart bridge using the Lutron app.